Okay, here we are. Ah! <laughs> thank you. What's how many to what wrote, how many of those are tomatoes? Oh, and thank you for the hydrate. I'll take a sip. Ah, good sip, good sip. All right, now we're good to actually play the game. <laughs> soon? Oh goodness. Well, soon? What do you mean soon? So, time for more of this game. We did a lot last time. I got five kingdoms already, and I just need seventeen. That's twelve more. I got this on lockdown. I should move my people though, because um, this 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 place is looking pretty unprotected right now. Let me march some extra people to here. Uh, I will replace this whooper guy, <laughs> this Magikarp guy. That Magikarp guy is not gonna help me out there. Oh, people are already throwing Pokeballs at me. Too bad, so sad. Premier Ball would be great if it worked. <laughs> then I'd be in a very nice Pokeball. When when do I get to transfer all the legendary into it? What do you mean transfer all the legendaries? You know, I do I do want. I, I, I had like this, I was actually thinking about this this morning, funnily enough, because I was thinking about my news resolutions and stuff. I do want my first collab of the year to be with Edma. So it'd be awesome to do, to be able to get into front lock. Take that first free spot. Because we were we were also talking about doing Pokemon Showdown when we when I was thinking about it and I was like, man, I'd really want to do, I really want to do some Pokemon with Enma. It could also be Century. That's true. We've been waiting on the Century collab for a while. <laughs> I still have the artwork that I prepared for it too. It's just kind of just waiting, waiting for its moment to shine. God, there's so, there's so many things we could do, Enma. So many things. Pokemon Showdown is fun. I just like to play it. Like, I, I never even do it like where I make teams. I just do random, and it's it's a lot of fun. Ow. Yeah, me... Me and Enma, we've talked about a lot of things. We need to do at least one of the things we've talked about. That, that's like something we definitely have to do just for the sake of doing it. Random everything is the best way, yeah. I'm just gonna have Magikarp go and get a present. Pick a place you should get food or lunch or you're just snacking till dinner. I told you, go get In-N-Out. Celebrate your In-N-Out day with some In-N-Out. Yeah, that's true. But uh, I'm always willing to like, I, I have a better schedule this semester too, so like I can always work something in. Ow. That one hit me right in the eye. Yes. Plus, Enma's just a cool person. Just throwing that out there. Yeah, Kurt just can't stop talking about Enma. Anytime we have a date, she's just like, Edma, Enma. <laughs> Alright, good. Have a good lurk, Madifer. Thank you so much for popping in. Guys, don't forget to drop a follow on Madifer. Please make sure you drop a follow before I did. <laughs> I did. Don't sleep on it like I did. Kurt actually has like a million points in Enma's channel and just hasn't spent them. Is waiting for Enma to make like the most expensive redeem ever. <laughs> oh. 
By the way, Fakazoo, have you been able to figure out uh, how stuff was going at OBS? Have you been able to manage it? I know I had a cut, like, I realized yesterday when my frames were dropping, when everyone said they were, my, my stream actually did go offline for a moment. I didn't realize it went offline. And I, I still don't know if that was, like, on Twitch's side or if that was, like, OBS being, like, problematic. Aw, oh, sweet dreams, Madditor. Very sweet dreams. Okay, I'm just gonna have the splash of the swooper so I can get some experience points. Kill the whooper. Oh, good luck, good luck. I really hope you got it figured out. Because it does it does suck, you know, with have technical issues are one thing where it's like you got like a little bit of a glitch or a bug. It, it's a whole other thing like when you just can't stream. Like it's just that bad. It's just, it's very discouraging. That's why even when I often have like, I mess something up in my stream setup, I'm like, it's a little annoying, but I'm ultimately fine with it. It's, it's way worse when like, like my internet is like, my internet's being poop or OBS is like fighting me. That, that is where I'm like, can I nickname the Pokemon? I don't think so. Let me check. I'm pretty sure you can't, like, physically name them. Not even your own. But we can just, you know, like, come up with a name together and just have that be the name. Yeah, right? Like, total disconnection is just so bad. Uh, and it's, like, even worse because, like, then your then your stream is, like... Some people... Like, so I've tried to, like, power through it before. But the thing is, like, then your VOD is separated into, like, numerous streams. And it's so annoying to have that. I just want it to all be... A, I wish there was a way to combine streams into one if you have a disconnect. Cause it bothers me. It gives me some. It gives me some like OCD about it. Riffy has to be Charmander. True. Although you're also a good Charmander. So I don't. Profile, which is there. Wham! A youth in possession of a rare talent to communicate on a deep level with Pokemon of all kinds. This warrior's friendship with Eevee dates back to childhood. Yeah, I don't have a way to name it. But hey, maybe we, maybe you guys can help me. What what should... Well, first of all, I, I still haven't figured out what I want to evolve my Eevee into. Um, I actually can evolve it at this point. I'm pretty sure I can almost evolve it. There are certain conditions and certain places that you need to be to evolve it. I kind of want to do it because I like Umbreon, but I don't know. What do you guys think? And depending on how you evolve it, like, it has, like, you know, it works a bit differently. It has a different move, different, different ability. You could pull, yeah. Last time Sylveon won pull, but unfortunately I cannot do Sylveon. I was like, oh well. The other and the other results were tied, so it didn't help. <laughs> Metal Claw. Uh, let me actually look up really quick. Double check the conditions to evolve. I'm pretty sure it's just like uh, like normal for the most part, except some of them are like specific things. Espeon all the way. Espeon's pretty cool.
I'm looking um, for the, the stats of the evolutions really quick. Okay, I got the evolution guide. So when we do decide, I'll be able to evolve the, uh, the Eevee. And we'll see. These guys need to level up a little bit. Poll will be two party. All right. So the poll is up, guys. Feel free to vote on that. We'll help us figure out what our Eevee is going to look like in this game. Got this in the bag. Go, Wooper! Water gun! Hold on. I just realized I need to fix my chair really quick. Oh gosh. My chair just went down. I pressed the lock. Long, long. My neck. Where's, where's my back support? It's like leaning a bit too far back and I'm trying to fix it. Where's the lever? I don't know how my chair works, guys. Where, where's my lever? That's so weird. I only feel one of them. Where's my other lever? When he is possessed, I am. I'm possessed by the need to fix my chair. But I can't. It doesn't help. I'm wearing my, my hand brace right now for my other hand. Because my wrist was like hurting a little bit earlier. Um, and I it's like very in the way. <laughs> oh, there it is. Thank you. I found it. It was like, it was like in a very weird place. It was further back than the forward one. But I wasn't reaching far enough, I guess. Don't you, yeah, don't you guys just like to watch me struggle? That's what we're here for, is watching me struggle. Where are the results at right now? We got one vote in the bowl for Espeon and Umbreon. Pulls up, guys. Don't be afraid to share your feelings. <laughs> Welcome to your life where you can never reach the top. It did feel like my arm was too short. Is this how you often feel? This poor Bidoof is getting ganged up on by me. <laughs> There's no diagonals in this game, by the way, so this Wooper can't diagonally turn out this Bidoof. Was that a Snacko exclusive explosion? Wait, what? Oh! <laughs> no, that was not an exclusive one. I... There was explosives. Is this stream already far back? I thought I thought I picked this up like a little bit ago. Go get some energy piplup. By the way, guys, can you get what I'm drinking? Hold on, I'll take I'll, I'll take a sip. And it, tell me if you can tell by the sound if you know what I'm drinking.
Not coffee. Not wine. And pass the wine. Perfect, she said to pass the wine. <laughs> no, I'm done with it. I don't need more wine, I swear. I've had enough. I've had enough on New Year's. <laughs> God, that wine messed me up. <laughs> it was it was 9% wine and that was enough. <laughs> it's enough to do damage to me. No! <laughs> I did it, did, haven't I had enough? <laughs> I don't want to become a drunkard. It wasn't even that good. <laughs> it's just some cheap wine. Just some cheap New Year's wine. I realized when I went to the store, the, I wanted to get the same wine that I usually have with my mom. Which is not too... It's not that... Uh, it's like 6%, I think. It's not that much. Um, but it's expensive. And I'm like, I'm, I'm, just a, I'm just a college student. I actually had a funny moment when I went up to the cashier. Um... I went up to the cashier to get the wine, and like the only thing I was getting was a bottle of wine and a six pack of my of of uh, Mike's Hard Lemonades because I like the lemonade and it had the strawberry lemonade flavor that I like. And I was like, I'll just have this. I'll have like a couple of these, and that should be fine. Just a couple drinks. Um, I was originally also gonna get some cider, <laughs> um, but. There was a lot of people, like, fighting for the cider, and I, there wasn't actually- I wanted to get, um, like, specifically, uh, the specific, uh, pomegranate cider or whatever, mm, but they were out, so I was like, whatever. Um, anyway, I went to the checkout, and, like, instinctively, I was like, hey, can I get the student discount on this? Because I always get the student discount when I go to the grocery store. I, I, I need to save the money. And the checkout person looked at me and he was like, Uh, we do not discount alcohol. Looking at me like I'm crazy. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> that I was joking. <laughs> I was embarrassed. It makes me lovable. <laughs> I'm not a drunk, I swear. I only drink for, like, special occasions. And I usually don't drink to get drunk. <laughs> Do you know how much money they would make if they did, though? <laughs> well, even more alcohol sales. They are- they sell alcohol enough. I- I am not an alcoholic, I swear. <laughs> hey, it's you again. Never thought I'd see you here. What do you think of this kingdom, huh? Wait, did he just take off his shirt? What? Huh? Did I imagine that? It looked like he suddenly lost clothing for a second. Well, it's quite far from Aurora, and there are lots of Pokemon here that we've never seen before. There sure are! You should link with some of them and make them your partners. Oh, maybe it was just an illusion. But, but we have Eevee and Jigglypuff! Sure. Oh, it's just because I don't see his whole sleeve anymore. It made him look like he had less clothes on. I... <laughs> sure, but don't you want to try getting to know some other Pokémon? Everyone's got their own perfect partner. By which I mean a Pokémon with whom you can have a perfect link. R really? Just remember that the number of Pokémon partners you have depends on your capacity. Anyway, I recommend you give some other Pokémon a try while you're here. Okay. So I actually need to get this guy away. I need him here so that I can get the magic harp. I will take who is the strongest? You. Oh yeah, but you guys still haven't guessed what I'm drinking.
so <laughs> she goes through those coasts quick, Riffy. Don't don't you worry about it. Okay, so there actually is a magic arp here. So the funny thing about this guy is his perfect link is a magic arp. Oh my god, everything had one vote. So the poll just ended for people who, who are not looking at it. Um, the options were Espeon, Umbreon. Uh, so basically in groups, Espeon slash Umbreon, Flareon slash Vaporeon slash Jolteon, Leafeon slash Glaceon, and Eevee. And they all got one vote. So we're nowhere closer to figuring out what I should evolve this Eevee into and what we're going to name our Eevee. Okay, how about this? How about this? Let's do it the opposite way. Hold on. What if we name the Eevee? Let's come up with a name for the Eevee, and then the, the name of the Eevee will inspire what, it, what we want to evolve it into. How about that? So see, look, he's got a gold thing above his head for Magikarp. So I'm going to link with it. This will be the perfect link. Is it male or female? It's whatever we want it to be. We can make him either. Let's assume it's a non-binary Eevee. Oh god, I, I do not want to name my Eevee chat. I could not live with that. Hello, my moody. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? By the way, you got a, I got a sub, a gifted sub from somebody. Watch as the linking lights flow towards you. Press the button as soon as the linking light. Okay, I forgot I have to do this. I gotta make sure that I that I do this good. Almost. He's running! Get him! Link, link. Ah. <laughs> the timing is a little hard for me on this DS. Now he has a Magikarp friend. Alright, how about this? We'll, we'll say that my Eevee, because um, I just feel like it, my Eevee is a girl. Okay, so it's a girl Eevee and we cannot name it Chad. <laughs> oh god! I'm gone! Help! Help! I- I'm- I can't come back! Okay, I'm back. I need to fix that. It, it really should have instantly ricocheted me off the screen. Thank you for the 100 bits, my moody. I appreciate it. Oh, goodness. <laughs> hey, Ansel. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. Name the Eevee Biscuit. Okay. Biscuit. I do like the name Biscuit. Any other so I just want to make this fair, because I could instantly take her suggestion because I love her. But I'll make this fair. Who else has a suggestion for what will name it be? Ah! Ah! Help! Help! I'm gone! Hundred bits. I'm gone. I'm back. You're on the top of the leaderboard, my moody. Did you know that? The bed monster is back. Don't worry, I'll get it. Just give me a second. I'll kill it. Did I say ricochet? I did. I did say ricochet. <laughs> uh oh. I didn't ask for this. Why did you bring me here? Place me back. I did not ask to be part of this. Well, I guess I'm here now. Yeah. I don't even know what's happening. What? What's wrong with my voice? This is just how I sound. 
What? What am I'm not a bed monster? I don't mean this isn't even what I choose to look like. Cute? I don't think that's intentional. If you think I look cute, you need to get your eyes checked. Well, at least this game looks interesting. The last time I was brought in here, it was some weird game where everything was small and pixely. This is also pixely. But a Pokemon made more sense to me. Who touched me? Who touched my head? I do not consent to that. Get away from me. It's about war, so I should love it. You're making a lot of- look, I know I look like this, but you're assuming a lot. Just because I look like this doesn't mean I love war. I love being left alone, how about that? There's a singular beef in this cave, and this army had six people in it. So the obvious thing is to put everyone in here. That's what it looks like to me, right? This is how it works. When you have an army, you send every everyone into every battle. This way you can cover the most ground. Listen, child. There is nothing that you can do about this. I am stuck here. I'm not here willingly. I was here. I was brought here against my will. I don't even know how long I'm supposed to be here for. I did. I did not say. I did not say that. I, I definitely did not say to touch me more. Definitely did not say that. If anything, I asked for less of that. Question, are you my mom? Do I look like a mother? The answer is no, I am not. Oh, hello, Sacker. I can tell you're there because of this giant notification in front of me. This, this screen is very busy. There are windows everywhere. There is an EV there. There are boxes. Right in front of my face. They keep popping up every time you guys talk. There is very little room for me to breathe here. It's very suffocating. The layout is clean? Well, you're not living in it. I think this layout could use some tidying up. Everything needs to be about 50 feet away from me at all times, and that'll be fine. What is, what is this thing on the view? The view has a pen. But only only some people can steal the penny for the beat, it looks like. Like this Piplup. This Piplup wants the penny for the beat. I should come live with you. Defense. Will I be forced to interact with everyone on a daily basis? If the answer is no, okay, I'll do. Where who is this lost child? Where did this lost child come from? Someone take them to the lost and found. Oh, I have to live with both of them too? I already have to deal with Leia. I don't know if I'm going to deal with her and her at the same time. It sounds like torture.
what happens? I have all of these Pokemon and none of them can do anything. This seems incorrect. Oh, here we go. I just have to attack my own Pokemon to attack this video. Mom, the strategy. You're going to love the fudge out of me. Well, bad news for you, I have no fudge to give. That was not a joke. Who is this lost child speaking to? There are no fathers here, certainly not me. I win. Can I leave now? Why are, why are all these numbers on the screen? Play Don't Start With Me and see how far you can get till you kill us. Wow, that sounds exciting for me. Getting to starve to death. Great. This one does not build with the sarcasm detector. Listen, kid. You're stuck with me for at least five more minutes. At least if that's how this actually works, it could have been changed. I hope it's not longer than that. I probably would quit. I could somehow find a way to quit this show. Trust me. Nothing will stop me. If you could kill me, I'll give you a medal. But I, I don't think you can. Not unless you can somehow inhabit the streaming world that I currently suck in. I can power suck so the stream. I have very little power. If I had any power, I wouldn't be here in the first place. I'm limited to this to this box. This invisible box that you can't see, but I can see. If I'm inside of it. This box with no buttons. Oh, perfect. Now I'm not only inside a box, I'm inside a little Pokeball. I'm in a Pokeball inside a box. Perfect. How many boxes do you have? Are you moving? If you are, then you're wasting your boxes. Do you know what you can do with a box you can sit in it? I think that's a better use of a box, honestly. You wish you see it small enough. Apparently you are. I haven't seen you, but I believe you are. Everyone makes short jokes about you all the time. You know, I'm also. L, I'm back. Wait, why am I like this? <laughs> why am I in TV bar? <laughs> hey guys, I'm. <laughs> Um, I guess this is me. I don't know. Um, I'll stay. You know what? I'll stay like this for a few minutes. <laughs> why not? I didn't. I don't know why I'm a chibi, but I am.
What are we doing? Are we fighting? Who are we fighting? I hope this is not a boss. Rocket just picked the first wham he saw. He just wanted to get the heck out. <laughs> he wanted to get the hecky out. <laughs> I am back. I was uh, I was summoned away. Uh, on the bright side, while I was gone, I, I got more gummies. It's definitely not some gummies I just randomly found next to me. I, I, I went and got more gummies while I was gone. I eated them. I miss the cutie. I mean, I did hear that he was here. How was how was he? Was he good? Was he nice to you guys? Do I have to scold him for anything? He's really evil? Don't talk about your brother that way. Ow. Okay, I can't do anything else, so I'll just end the turn here. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> oh, so close, Kurt. So close. Ah. Who's gonna catch this limited edition Chibi Wham? Do you guys like my outfit, by the way? Ow! I want to credit again. I forgot to do it earlier. Credit to B-E-R-Y-L, Barrel. Kofi for making this very cute kimono set. I think I said it right. Yeah, barrel. B E R Y L. And if you want a kimono set, I recommend this. Ah! <laughs> Getting closer and closer. Anyone else want to answer the question of the day, by the way? Question of the day is still, what is your favorite sleepover or summer party activity? I haven't had a sleepover in a long time, but I'm just curious. I'll switch back to my to what I'm supposed to look like now. I'm back. Ah. If you want Chibi Wham, that's a redeem. So if you like that one. sleeping. Ah. My goodness. What did Rocket Me throw me into? SMH. Oh good, they're finally waking up now. <laughs> Can you kill Rocket Mew? Why would you want to kill Rocket Mew? What did Rocket Mew do to you guys while it's gone? He's evil? Why is he evil? Did he say something mean to you? I'm sure he didn't mean it. Ow. <laughs> oh god. That Pokeball somehow broke my neck before it even hit me. No rocket me. Ah.
Wait, can you do this, I wonder? Do what? Is Kurt trying to hack the system? Ah, oh my god, Kurt! Kurt! Kurt, my goodness! There's still a cooldown, even if you do that. And we gotta put you in timeout, Kurt. Yes, you did hit me with Pokeballs, that's true. You have my eternal gratitude for extending his olive branch. Yeah, let me move him, um... These are all full, so I'll, I'll put them over here. And I'm going to temporarily move um, a few people just so that I can train them. Yes, you can catch anyone. People just like to throw Pokeballs at me to get the special achievement of catching me. Who can say that his father is famous? Not many people, although I'm sure there's some people who can say it, like um, the son of famous people. <laughs> yeah, if you catch me, a special animation happens on stream, but you can only see it if you manage to catch me. Somewhere around that range. I should change the catch rate to be more random, but it, it is just set at 98% at the moment. You know, something you could do is you can link with other Pokemon. Like, I can link with this Trico. And some people do do that to, like, temporarily get through um, the fighting person. But I like my Eevee. You know what? I think I will get Trico. I love Trico. I love Trico. I'm not even phased by all these Pokeballs anymore. <laughs> all right. Take care of yourself, Kurt. Have a good lay down. Make sure to hey, make sure to get food. You better get food, like real food, okay? <laughs> nice try. <laughs> Alright, time to slap this carnivine. Oh my god, Jigglypuff, those are some good hits. Hey, Ferret, how are you doing? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, this is a game. This is Pokemon Conquest. The crossover with Nobunaga. It's a really fun game. Story time. Would you like a random story? I have a story. I've been waiting on someone to redeem the story for a while. It's a pretty funny story. The timer ball is pretty good, Ace. Well, that one works better the longer the stream is gone. 
stream's only been on for about an hour, so it's not too good yet. But the longer the stream goes, the better it gets. Okay, how about I... A bedtime story for you. Well, the way story time, story time works is I tell you a story of something that's happened to me. Either something funny, or something interesting, or just something that happened recently that I haven't talked about yet. I used to make up stories, but it turns out I'm not very good at that, so I usually just tell actual stories now. I think, okay, I can tell you a funny story. Here's a funny story about the only time I made a Tinder account and I made a Tinder account for my brother. Yes, um... Can you see if someone has caught you? Hmm. That's a good question. I don't know if you can. I think if you try to catch yourself... If, mm, sometimes it tells you if you've been caught already. Or if someone else tries to catch you, it tells you if you've been caught. But okay. So here's the story of how I made a Tinder account for my brother. <laughs> So this was back when I was still living with my roommates. Um, my roommate often had people over, like her friends over to hang out. And so I try to be social and hang out with them. There was one time where she had a few people over and this included this, uh, this guy who they're very close friends with and his girlfriend. And this girlfriend was like, I gotta say she was kind of mean. <laughs> she was, um, so we were supposed to watch a movie that night after we hung out at the pool. It was during the summer and um, she wanted to watch a scary movie, like a really terrifying movie. Um, I wasn't super into it. I wasn't super into it um, and neither was my roommate. Um, we were both a little sensitive to scary movies and the one that they, she wanted to watch specifically um, had some triggers for my roommate. So my roommate said, hey, can we watch something else instead? And everyone agreed to that. Um, and it seemed like she was fine with it. But then after like 10 minutes of hanging out in the pool, she made an excuse. Like she was just suddenly like, I need to go. And she left and uh, took her like her. She like made her boyfriend leave with her, even though her boyfriend was having a lot of fun and didn't really want to go. Uh, she was like, you need to come back with me. And apparently, um, after they left, uh, the rest of uh, my roommate's friends started talking. And apparently, like, this was, like, a common thing. You know, like, you would do one thing that she didn't like, and it would, like, set her off. And, like, she would just, you know, like, totally abscond and, like, was kind of controlling her boyfriend a bit. So, when they're talking about it, they're like, you know, we kind of suspect, like, she's had this problem before, where... She would, like, apparently this girlfriend would, like, scope out Tinder for other dude. And they were suspecting that she was doing it again. <laughs> the reasons you stay single, yeah. But, um, they are talking about it and they're like, they were like, maybe we should try checking and seeing if, like, if she's on Tinder, if she'll, like, talk to us. And see if she's, like, like, being, you know, like, cheating on him. But they, they were all like, well, none of us can do it because we already, like, have Tinder accounts that she'll know it's us. And um, while this we were talking about this, I was like, um, I mean, I don't have a Tinder account. And they are like, hey, can you make a Tinder account really quick? Another thing was, of course, uh, this would be, like, looking for a dude. So I was like, okay, um, I guess I'll make one. Um, but what? I don't really have a lot of pictures of guys on my phone. I don't know, like, a good picture to use that's not obviously a catfish. And I was just kind of, like, looking through my photos, just looking for, like, a photo of a friend or something to use. But the only photo that I could find that might be okay to use, and that they said would be kind of close to her type, was a picture of my brother. And it was a really stupid picture, too. <laughs> It was, uh, it was a shirtless picture of him. It was a picture that I took when he was visiting us for one Christmas. Um, and it was a picture of him, like, stepping, like, pretending to step on our dog. Which is why I took the picture. It was kind of funny. He was, like, 
one foot on my dog's head, my dog looking at him confused. And he happened to be shirtless because, you know, dudes just walk around the house like that. If, you know, they don't care. So I was like, okay, I'll use this picture. Um, my brother shouldn't find this. You know, I don't live where my brother lives. So I did that. I made an Emmett to Nerd account and I used a fake name and everything. And I was like, <laughs> can't confirm if at home, no shirt, can't confirm. The, p the dudes in chat confirm. Hey, Bernie, thank you for coming back. Hey, no problem. I like to drop the follows when I can. I, I'm, try I'm trying to remember to drop follows on people that I want to check out. I always forget. <laughs> I am playing a Pokemon game, yes. I'm trying to tell a story about Tinder and also play Pokemon at the same time. Now, I, I scoped Tinder. I did scope Tinder with this account. Um, never found her, never found her profile. We tried really hard to like make it specifically catered to her too. We never found her though, um, so I guess she wasn't on Tinder. Um, my brother, my brother did get a super like though. <laughs> I have since deleted the account because my brother is married and in a relationship, and it would have been really weird if if uh, his wife found that Tinder account. I mean, that would have been very hard to explain. Where that came from. I mean, I, I, you know. It's kind of an automatic thing. I can't really check people out all the time. Um, like, on stream. So, if I, I think, if it seems like you're a streamer, I drop a follow so I can look back later and, you know, see what kind of stuff you got. I have followed people without, without any streams, and I'm just like, well, um... I guess I follow you now and you don't post anything. <laughs> Doesn't hurt. My guess is correct. I assume so. <laughs> Sometimes the name helps. Plus there are people that I've like followed who are like pre-debut and stuff. So like even if they don't have anything, they'll like eventually start streaming and I like to check them out when they do start. Oh, wow, 500 followers? Congrats on the milestone. That is awesome. What a great start to the year. Anyway, I hope you like the, the story. <laughs> I've been wanting. To, I re, I remembered that story like a couple weeks ago, and I I wrote it down as soon as I remembered it because I was like, I gotta share this on stream the next time someone redeems it. Yeah, that too. Like I I want to make sure if I raid some. I used to do random raids too, but um, I I have heard of the thing where you like, you know. It ends up that whoever you randomly raid is not like the best person to raid, especially maybe it doesn't fit your content or your rating. Um, so I try not to do that anymore. <laughs> try to, you know, do some scoping. Try having furry in your name. <laughs> Have the issue of being European. Oh, that's yeah. I I follow I follow and watch some European like like Thane and stuff, and I I try really hard to like catch them because Thane streams early, and I I sleep in a lot, especially now I sleep in a lot. How did I get my VTube model? I actually made my VTuber model. Um, I drew it up and rigged it myself in uh, Live 2D Cubism. If you can't tell, this was the this is like the, the first model I made, and I made it in the free edition of Live CD. It is possible to use just the free edition and get pretty much most of what I got going on in this model. Um, although now I actually have the the actual like I purchased it for my future models. At some point during this year, I want to update this model, but um, yeah, I just made it all myself. There's a lot of tutorials on YouTube and stuff about how to put models together. So it wasn't too like it. It did take time to do it, but 
but um, it was worth it in my opinion because now I can modify my own models and do my own stuff. Um, there is a way to like, you can always buy parts of the model separate. Some people do their own art and then ask someone else to rig it. They, they purchase rigging from someone else. Or some people do the opposite where um, they ask for art to rig. Ah, uh, you're from America and most of your viewers from the UK and you don't know why. It could be like um, the time that you're free is when they're like free in a weird way. It could, it could be like you, your schedule. Streaming is a little weird for me because I'm in Pacific Standard Time, which um, means if I stream late, it is often later for a lot of people in America. It is way later. So like Friday, I stream in the evenings, so I get a very different crowd than I usually would get when I do my uh, my early afternoon streams. But I moved my streams to be earlier afternoon because like this is more of the later afternoon for most people in America, so it's easier to catch people here. But people in my time zone are usually like at work and stuff. So like uh, for Kurt, for example, she would usually be working until later, so I don't always get them in my the early part of the streams when I do this. Timing streams can be a little weird. That is true. You could just be you could just be a PNG tuber. PNG tubers are great. That's where I started from, actually, and I still have my PNG tuber uh, setup. I have it as a redeem too. I don't have it on right now because I had Rocket Me today, um, but I have a redeem to go back to my PNG form. If I see Wham go live, I just drop stuff. I used to like, um, I used to watch people in the morning when I would be at work and stuff. And like, even if I was working at the office, I would just like kind of put a stream on the corner of my screen to watch while I was working. Oh, there's a lot of people here right now. Um, let's see. I should be good with this team. These are pretty strong people. Ah! Oh, you're saving it for a face reveal. That's cool. Nice, nice. Sometimes I forget that people can just show their face. <laughs> Could it be me? <laughs> Discovering PNG tubers and stuff was actually what got me back into streaming because I was like, wow, I can stream without showing my face? Damn, it's just a wham. <laughs> oh, my moody's been caught. Rip. Oh, but released. Catch and release moment. <laughs> You're caught. I'm not surprised. People get crazy with the catch command in here. Like Valkyrie or Darkness, they they would they start trying to catch everyone. Yeah, put 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 them to sleep. Use Yawn. It's so cute. What channel is that from? The Chunk? Is that just a that's just a Twitch emote? Oh my God! Hold on. Wait, hold on one sec. Hold on. Lechonk! Look at him! There he goes! There he goes, that cutie. Thank you for the pat pat, my moody. Oh god, Charmander is surrounded. I know you want a weak cat emote. That reminds me, I need to update my emotes again. Because I have I have made some new emotes and I need to um, decide what I'm going to be using on Twitch on my emote slot.
I need to kill some of these guys quick. You should. New emotes are great. Oh god, this freaking bird. Emote shuffle is real. Yeah, I think I need to... I think I've shuffled out... I oh, know I haven't yet, but at some point I need to shuffle out the, the Cult of the Wham emote I have. Because I'm not playing that game right now. So it's not going to get too much use, I don't think. Nice melee. I need to get um, this rufflet, most of all, honestly. This rufflet and this, um... This Ralts. Ah, oh, that's okay, my moody. Your English is really good. I could not tell that you're not from America or England. God, I can't attack any of these guys. This is so annoying. It's gonna come down. I'd love to see you do more Cult of the Lamb. You should definitely do it. I don't know if I will. I, I spent a very long time on that playthrough just to finish it. <laughs> but I will probably play it on my off time just to see how it's going. They are a lot of fun. I'm just very bad at that game. <laughs> It's very, yeah. No, I, I figured it was late for you because last time you also said that you're, you needed to sleep too, if I remember. So I figured that you were a lot later. Very different time zone. It's pretty amazing that you can even manage to make it, honestly. But it's cool. Oh man, that would be, that would be different. I've gotten used to the role canceling. I can't imagine. <laughs> That would be unfortunate if it was if it didn't work anymore. I don't think I'm gonna get all these warriors. I think I already passed four turns. At least I'm about to. <laughs> what is a whamulet? That is the question. What is a whamulet? I have had people ask me before, like, what, what my name is supposed to come from. Because you, no one, no one, have, no one really, there's no way to guess what my name comes from. It's very random. <laughs> oh, shoot, I didn't mean to wait. Crap. I have talked about it before. I've, I've talked about it at least twice on stream. Because it has come up before. Oh, Brufflet's dead. So you confessed you watched a random V-Theater just because they were playing the best Pokemon spin-off. And as punishment, you had to play FNAF. Why punishment? That's a good truth to admit. This is a great Pokemon spinoff, and it deserves the love. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I will take a sippy. <laughs> Nightbot is impossible. Nightbot is lurking in the darkness, trying to hide. <laughs> Their words. Maybe they need. You should. You should play it. <laughs> Called you a pixel sip. <laughs> oh, so harsh. You know what? Tell them to actually check me out, and they'll understand. They'll also, then they'll also become the Pixel Sims. <laughs> Someone spent 10k channel points? Wow. Okay, that is really funny, though. <laughs> that is really funny. Your name is Metal... Well, Metal Fur. Yep. 
People already use the names they changed it to wait, hold on. Full Metal Furt. Oh, but someone already hold on. someone already used that name? Wow, that is surprising. I would have thought that it was like really original. At some point you made a typo on a platform side up and now you're a furry. Oh, so you weren't you weren't originally furry? <laughs> oh my god, that is so funny. What a typo that must have been. Bernie Games is totally original. <laughs> but yeah, in case you're curious, um, my amulet is an anagram, anagram of an older username that I went by. I wanted to change my original username. So I mixed it up and I got Whamulet and I was like, oh, that's a cool name. No one is ev no one is ever going to use the name Whamulet anywhere. So people are going to know for sure. Like who are like if if you hear the name Whamulet, you're going to you're going to know who I am. And if you don't know who I am, you're going to you're going to find out and remember forever. Also, it starts with the word wham, and I was like, that's awesome. <laughs> if you can't tell, I made up the name Whamula in, like, middle school. Nice. Good job, Aislaw. I love Full Metal Alchemist. I did figure when you said that you're, you're originally Full Metal that it was based on that. Snack time? Rocket Moo gave you some cereal. I want cereal. What's your guys' favorite cereal? I love Cocoa Pebbles. Or Trick. Actually, no, I take it back. I love Tricks. I love the original Trick cereal. Eggs. What do you mean, eggs? That's not a cereal. You don't get to eat them? Why? Why can't you eat them? Oh, you like loops because of the cat meme? Wait, why can't you eat fruit loops? This is a genuine concern I have. Okay, let's see who I can recruit. Just one. Ugh. I was not I was too slow for the others. Um, I'm not sure, Mamoudi. Depends what language you speak. If it's Portuguese, I might kind of understand it. Oh, because your wallet doesn't allow you? Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Chomp, chomp, chomp. All right, let's see who's here. There's Tepig. Does anyone have perfect link with Tepig? Nomosa. Do I have Nomosa? If only you didn't say it was 1am, then I would have hoped it was Dutch. Aw. Someday, Bernie, you'll find another Dutch person. The only words that I understood were Wham, Minen, and Paris. And that's because the two of those words were Pokemon names. And I, well, I, I honestly don't know if those are the Pokemon or just words. <laughs> I'm going to say I at least understood one word. Okay, I do not have Nomosa. I can just, you know, fight the Tepig, I guess. Scandinavian. Sounds Finnish, but could be Norwegian, Swedish, or da Danish. Wow, good guess, Bernie. Good guess. I am not as great with languages as Bernie is. <laughs> I have still not been caught. <laughs> Let's 
40% of your community managed to be finished while 50% is German. <laughs> I'm telling you, like, the times that people normally stream, like, manage to make streams happen is, is weirdly enough, not in a time for their main time zone. It's always, like, something adjacent to it. It's interesting and, and strange, but that's just how it be. Yes, I am in Pacific time. And there are people in my, in my community from Pacific time, for sure. Um... There's at least one. That's Kurt. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> that's all I know for sure. <laughs> I'm pretty. I, I don't know anyone else in Pacific Time other than Kurt. <laughs> yeah, it is difficult. And Kurt can often always be here because in Pacific Time it's 2 p.m. and she's at work. Hey, Aurelia, how are you? Okay, let me migrate a couple people over. If I can just click the right button, I can't. Doing good? That's good. In case uh, you guys haven't answered the question of the day yet, because we have a new people hopping in and out. Uh, question of the day today is, what do you like to do as a slumber party or sleepover game ac activity? Well, that's not going to be hard for everyone, obviously, my moody. <laughs> for the people in a different time zone, that's fine. It's depending on what time zone you're in. Sleep. You going to go to sleep, fairy? I called- this is the first time I've called you by the first part of your name, and it's weird, because it just sounds like I'm calling you a furry. <laughs> it is 15.30- yes, it is. For people who do not know global time, or sorry, uh, what do, what do we call it here? Military time? That's 3.21. Oh, it doesn't make me uncomfortable, it's just funny. <laughs> I, I'll call you whatever you like to be called. Try to say... Mena, Mena, Olin, Paris? Is that how you say any of those words? I guessed on all of them. Oh, I do know military time. <laughs> I'm just saying for anyone who might not know. A lot of people in the US don't really use military time. I'm familiar with it because, you know, I have family is Mexican. Whenever I go to Mexico, that's what they use. Oh, you'd sleep. Okay. <laughs> that's fair. That's a fair sleepover activity. <laughs> that's not usually my go-to. I'm the kind of hyper one who wants to keep the sleepover going as long as possible. Oh, Nobu Chica also has a perfect link with this dude. Hold on, let me check something. Nobu Chica? Oh, he is. Okay. Sure, why not? It's your perfect link. Why would I not give it to you? You would grab your phone and pass out watching YouTube? <laughs> I mean, that's also valid. If you guys just like to hang out and watch YouTube videos together, that's totally valid. Oh, you know some Norwegian Aurelia? Nice. I'm sad to say I'm not very good at languages. It's a ferret. Say a word and you'll say it in Finnish. Um, pancake.
Oh, that's so cute. I'd oh, I need to check out the third onesie. Oh, there are onesie. Hold on. Wait. I want to see the onesie. I'll need to check that out. It's so cute. Bird army, yeah! <laughs> that, oh my god, there's so many cute birds. Did somebody say ferrets? That is true. Bernie does have all the ferrets. What does Jata mean? Ja means ice. That red furries were 10k. Wow. That is an expensive fur it. Worth it. Good luck getting that one. <laughs> you gotta be careful you challenge people too. People will commit. Although I guess for you that works out just fine. Oh no, what will I do? People giving me money? Oh no. <laughs> Has an introduction been made between Bernie and Furry? I'm surprised I've not been caught yet. There's been a lot of Pokeballs been thrown at me. <laughs> oh, you're making some line art? Oh, by the way, Aurelia, did you decide what you're gonna do? I know you're having some struggles between choosing Bunny and Kitty. And figure it out. Wait, what's the what's the major issue at Pacific Time? Please let me know. That's what I was gonna say. Like, you know, if you can't decide between like an, like a couple things, you should just combine them into something new and beautiful. You went with bunny deer. Nice. That's cute. Oh, does anyone have a perfect link with either Starly or Manchino? I don't have cha-cha. Never mind then. But really a bunny with deer antlers and markings. Still cute. Still cute. Honestly, you just need to put that, the aspects that you like together into one creature. And that's what matters, you know? You know, I when I went with the ringtail Sona, like I got us like look at look at me. I'm not the perfect rendition of like a of a ringtail. I, I I went a little I went a little creative with my interpretation, but I I like where where it went where it took me. A bun year. <laughs> The little tiny major issue Pacific time is that your stream starts at 6 a.m. Yeah, yeah, that, you know what? Yeah, uh, that I'm already foreseeing a problem there. I don't know exactly what time that is for me. Hey, wait, are you saying it's 6 a.m. Pacific time? <laughs> Bruh. I did, did to wake up early. So here's the thing, I did used to wake up early, and I did used to be up that early, and I was able to catch some early streamers, actually, some European streamers, like Thane, for example. Um, but recently, because I'm on break and stuff, I've been sleeping in a lot more. When I'm I, when I'm on a work schedule, I do wake up around, you know, 6 to 7, um, because my dog, I usually take him out pretty early to the park and stuff. Although that was also in summer, and now it's winter, and I want to sleep in winter more. <laughs> So maybe, maybe someday I'll catch you, Bernie. Someday, when it's not cold and I'm tired all the time. Yeah, you're, CST for you, Aurel 
Aurelia is like, it's not too bad, right? It's like, we're closer together. The stream starts at zero for Mamoudi. Oh my goodness, Mamoudi. How did, how did you even manage to fight me? I would have been sleeping at that point. <laughs> Nobunaga just attacked you, but you're playing Nyx. <laughs> he just followed you. He just, he's tracked you down. Magikarp, go get him. Hello, Nova. What's up? Are you peeking in? Hold on, I gotta check something really quick. Are you streaming? It could be worse, Mamoudi. If it was Friday, my stream would start at 5 a.m. for you. <laughs> Big L. You read Nova Patra? <laughs> Who's Nova Patra? Why did it scare you? It's like Cleopatra. What makes you think you're streaming? Um, because you always come in while you're streaming. You little, little weirdo. You little, little sneaker peeker. But you're not streaming right now, so I'll, I'll let it slide this time. No. I just had to check. Yes, you do. Don't you lie. You always do that. I didn't mean to start crying. I just... <laughs> My expression went on a little trip that. <laughs> a little trip. It's in the chat settings, Aurelia. Uh, the little... I believe the little, um, the little gear icon. Magikarp is such a struggle to, to level up. You think I have the cap? Yes, you do, Nova. Well, you do. <laughs> Especially when you're working on art. That's all you do is you lurk in other people's streams and sneak in, sneak in there, you little sneaky. <laughs> so you can screw up six different- That's where I'm at, Bernie, with multitasking. Screwing up everything at one time. I do not have the capacity to do multiple things. You can see this when I'm like chat when I'm chatting or in the middle of like telling a story. You'll see that my gameplay, I'm very slow at doing stuff. <laughs> professional idiot you know you're not a streamer if your chat doesn't constantly make fun of you for you know breaking things up <laughs> ow who hit me that would be weird i wonder what weirdo does that um Exactly. They they they're there to watch you screw up. So in, so in a way, it's perfect. It works out perfectly fine. That's what they want. That's what they that's what they crave. <laughs> they want you to fail. No one's here to see me win this game. No one to see me struggle. <laughs> Question of the day. Aurelia says, haven't had a sleepover since year five. Ah. Uh, I haven't had a sleepover in a very long time either. I don't I don't think I once you're an adult, you kind of stop having sleepovers, TBH. It's a sad part of being an adult. People are too busy for sleepovers. Imagine being able to successfully hide the fact you're alive to people you're chatting with in the live. You can't hide it anymore, now that I know your secret. Your secret has been has been spilled to me. That's why I checked. 
Among Us for lack of knowing your original name. <laughs> Wait, it's not? Wait, is that not the original name? I'm pretty sure that's the original name of the game, Among Us. It is, right? I know that it's been memefied, but I'm pretty sure that's the correct name. Ah, uh, your timer ball was not good enough. I'm a legendary Pokemon. I'm the one that you have to throw, like, every single one of your Pokeballs at before you catch me. See, no, that's the thing, Nova. That's not a sleepover. You have to be awake for the sleepover. There's a sleepover where you need to wink and you steal the person. Hmm, what? This is a new game to me. <laughs> yes, Mamoodi? What's up? Who ratted you out this time? Yourself. I just had- I had- it was- it was me who ratted you out. It was my instincts. My instincts ratted you out. You need to avoid the person without- to steal yours by- wait. Huh? Does anyone know what this game is? Is it Duck Duck Goose? What is Kisa? What- I don't know what Kisa is. You, you might need to ask someone who speaks Finnish, or at least something adjacent to Finnish. Bernie, do you know what, what Mamoudi's talking about? All I, the only languages I know is English and Spanish. <gasps> Wait, hold on. I gotta set up my type, too. Let's see. You guys are sharing all these words, I don't know. <laughs> I'm very dumb in other languages. Cat? Is it cat? I did see your schedule, I did retreat it. Ow. That doesn't mean- I know that you spontaneously stream sometimes, though. What? Wait, I can have a perfect link with this? Hmm... Hmm... Nah, I don't need it. That's interesting. Wow, M does not translate chat. I am very limited in my capabilities. <laughs> Bro, it ate my super potion. I hate you. I forgot that it does that. That super potion was expensive. Bah. Now I'm going to have to buy another one. Yes, you are getting called out. As is custom. As is custom, you must bully bully Nova into submission. What's my favorite Caterpie clone bug type? Like Weedle, Wormple, etc. Hmm. I do definitely have a favorite. Um. Hmm. Hold on, let me look really quick at the list of, of, of clones. Uh, let me pull up a page, just to make sure. Caterpie clones in Pokemon. There's only one answer. Okay, I found the list. Hold on. Careful, half careful. Um, so the clones for um, the cocoon, the bug lines. It says here Caterpie, Weedle. In Gen two, the closest thing would be Lediba, Spinarak. Gen three, Wurmple. Gen four, Burmy. Gen five, Sawaddle and Venipede. 
and then Gen 6 Scatterbug. My favorite of those is Venipede. I love Venipede and Scolipede. And Whirlipede. <laughs> Venipede gang, let's go rise up! Oh, you know what? That reminds me. In this game, actually, in this game, I would always, uh, at least one time I did, for my secondary partner, um, I usually get Trico, and I also like to get Venipede because I love Scolipede so much. I need to get, I need to get one. That's my goal now. I love, I have a shiny, I worked really hard in my, uh, in Pokemon X and Y to breed a shiny Venipede with uh, like the stats and EVs that I wanted. I love that shiny, that shiny. I can't wait till I can transfer it over. You know what you love? Um, what? Oh, goodness. All right, guys, we're going to do Birdsong. If you don't know what Birdsong is, you'll see in a second. Lyrics will show up in chat if you want to sing along, though. Cookie in my mouth, it tastes so sweet. But when I drop it, then I go tweet. Birdsong complete. It curses me. Ooh, you want a shiny furret? Ah, oh, I need to get a shiny furret. I love, I love furret too. Hi, Aurelia. Furret is a definition of base. True. God, this stupid thing is so hard to kill. Okay, I'm gonna move. Oh, well, no, no, I can't do anything with that. Jigglypuff, slap it. To real? What command is that gonna be? I wonder- you wonder why I like furry? Hmm, I wonder. What- what about shiny furret appeals to me? What about shiny furret do I like? Hmm. You know what I should do? I should draw myself as a shiny furret. What I- would my interpret- what I would be as a furret. Ah! <laughs> Aurelia! <laughs> There's so many things at me, why? <laughs> Oh, Nova, you're gonna confuse the people who don't know what that is. Because <laughs> I didn't make you noodles? I'm sorry. I couldn't make you noodles. Wait, this thing heal. It's freaking use my super potion. This thing is freaking gonna make me lose my streak. I'm upset. Oh my god. This thing is impossible to kill. It keeps healing itself. You know, I don't even care if this ends. I'm- I'm tired of this swaddle. I want it to go away. Hey, Inamar! Oh, thanks for the resub! Welcome, welcome to the stream! I hate this swaddle. Okay, there's one chance that I can end this battle. And I have to link with it. I have to do a perfect link, so let's go for this. Nope, wasn't good enough. Time's up. This stupid sawaddle. You know what? I don't care that I didn't link with it. It was- it was so annoying. <laughs> the chat is just full of blanks. <laughs> Listen. 
This Saladil stole my super potion. It stole my super potion. What a jerk face it is. Speaking of which, I need to buy a new super potion now. <laughs> Kill issue! How dare you! How dare you! <laughs> That's the thing. You become the chat that always bullies you. You become them now. <gasps> a Joltik! Oh my god, I love Joltik! I love Joltik so much. Oh! <laughs> I have been caught. <laughs> Congratulations, Inamar, you caught me. We did what everyone else has been struggling to do this whole time. <laughs> ah, that's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> like one of your first tries. You thought I was nuzlocking this game? I never said that. I never declared anything about this. <laughs> oh, poor Bernie. What is the perfect link for Joltik? I just want to see really quick. Motozani. I don't think I have that person. Don't recognize that name. Let me see. No, 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 no. Don't advance. What is up, Mamoodi? I don't have anyone with electric type, yeah. Kick the bed monster? Okay. I'll kick it in the butt. Get him a hammer ready right now. 2% <laughs> you got got. <laughs> I, I really, Aurelius is really good. No, you did not say that. We did not say that, Nova. You know what I, you know what I do remember, Nova? I said, man, tomorrow, I need to make sure that I time out some uh, someone named Nova in my chat if they get too heckling. <laughs> so I'm going to temporarily switch to Trico. Um, because the next person has fighting type Pokemon, so I need to get different Pokemon for them. Oh, you know what? I should do Chrysalia. I should do Chrysalia so I can get a Venipede, actually. That's a good idea, me. Let me switch back to Eevee really quick. Nightbot, he's making me moderator. <laughs> Okay, so let's get some people for Chrysalia. They have bug types, so I have a lot of fire types here, which is good. But they also have a Spiel, which has... I believe the Spiel will always have an ice type move. Um, but I should bring an electric type, just in case, anyway. Where are my electric types? I have one, don't I? I thought I had one electric type person. I guess not. I guess I didn't get one yet. Alright, well, it should be fine. I should be able to do without an electric type. I will just bring a swaddle to handle, uh... Hmm... No, actually, I have two normal types. I should be fine. So let me move people around. I'll bring both of us, of course, to Biolite. And I will switch out this guy. And then really quick, nope. Um, 
I need to make sure that I have their perfect length set up. So who had uh, this guy? Ha nope, nope, not that one. This guy has a perfect link with Magikarp, so I need to switch that. And this guy also has a perfect link with Magikarp. What happens if I lose? Um, then they'll probably come beat me up in my kingdom, probably. That's probably what's gonna happen, is they come to my kingdom to beat me up. <laughs> okay, everything looks fine. Let me just march this person here so that there's a bit more strength here. And let me move all the Magikarps to here. There. That should be good now. Should be- that's a little bit better than it was before. Um, actually, let me march more people to the other kingdoms. Your chat won the Great Fur at War. What was the Great Fur at War? Is it like the Great Emu War? Okay. There we go. That's a lot better. So let's go ahead and start by attacking Cresselia. No, <laughs> that's not why you have that as a standard emote. I think that's a worthy prize. <laughs> nice, nice. I love it. Oh, you know, I just realized what time it is. Um, before we actually do this fight, I will set up for this fight. But I need to do a... I need to do a quick break, so let me just select everyone for the fight. But before we actually do it, I'm going to take a quick break, um, replenish my snack and drink. Um, while I'm gone, feel free to hang out, battle me if you can. Uh, you'll see some prompts during the little ad break we do, and I will be back in just a second to continue with more Pokemon Conquest. Alright, see you guys soon. Take care. I am back, gang. I hope I'm back. Am I back? I think I'm back. Are the ads still running? Someone let me know. I seem back. Okay, good. Is I'm no the Whamburger's not real. Whamulet's real. Alright. So we're back. We're ready to head into battle and I got more gummies. The ads are still running. How do you know? How would you hear me if they're still running? <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. What a conundrum this is. Also, I just saw that Mops also answered the question of the day. Mops said that for sleepovers, you play Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes. That's a good game. I like that game a lot. It's really fun to watch people play it. I'd like to play it for myself one day. If you guys don't know what that game is, it's a game where uh, you basically have to work with a team, or a, the one other person or a team, to defuse a bomb. One person has the bomb, and the other person has the instruction manual. And you have to communicate what the instruction manual says to do. And you have to communicate what the bomb looks like, the person with the manual. Very fun! Crinkle, crinkle, I'm opening this bag of gummies. Oh, Pokemari is just such glorious fun! Lord Yoshimoto, someone has come to challenge you to battle. And little Pineco just gets more adorable every day. Oh! Lord Yoshimoto! Oh! Your opponent in battle is to be Wham! Wham? Is that the one who's been expanding his- Excuse me, her territory. Or the other one? Oh, it doesn't matter. As long as they want to play Pokemari with me, I don't care who they are. 
Ow. You must think I'm Nobunaga, which is- I have a very different name to Nobunaga. You have a record. No bomb has ever lasted with a timer going below 10 seconds. They blow up before then. <laughs> nice. Come, Wham, to the battlefield where we shall play Bokumari to our heart's content. I don't know if you want to be a warlord or just a professional Bokumari player, dude. Is Rock and me sleeping? Rock, can you wake up? There we go. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, okay. Rock and me was sleeping. I had to poke Rock and me really quick. <laughs> num 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 <laughs> no don't worry i'll eventually release myself and give you guys another chance Let's try this. And wait. There you go. New outfit. New outfit, new wham. Alright guys, you get another chance. Try to catch me again. <laughs> Everyone's- oh god, you're right, he is explosive. So I, I, I do remember how this one works a little bit. So I'm gonna um, move him last because he's kind of weak to those guys. And I'm gonna keep them here. And then I'm going to wait behind this Pokemari ball. And I'll keep them there, because they'll be safe there. Alright. You go, Yoshimoto. Be gentle on me, please. No. This is war, Yoshimoto. All is fair in love and war. And war... Oh, great. All right, let's try this on for size. Bit of trivia for you. Pineco was originally based on a grenade, specifically the pineapple grenade. Which be why it becomes steel type when it evolves. That makes a lot of sense. It does look like that. Interesting. That makes a lot whole a whole lot of sense. Oh great. More poison. I'm gonna do run up first. And then we're gonna go after his Pineco. So it's pretty defensive at least, so he's not gonna die instantly. Good job for you. Ooh, critical hit though. Hell yeah. Ugh, that poison. Well, Ugly Tough's not a fairy type yet, so I have that going for me. His pineapple's just gonna chill there, okay. Mm. 
Jigglypuff, you can take this, right? Pronounce what that way? What did I pronounce weird? An echo? Is that not how you say it? Is it... Pineco? Hold on. But Pineco sounds weird. I, pre I prefer Pineco. It sounds cooler that way. Like pine cone? I guess that's true. But the other way sounds cooler. And I'm all about the rule of cool. But now you're thinking of cat made of apple pie? <laughs> what? How does pineapple make you think? Oh, I see. <laughs> Listen, that's just how my brain has told me it's pronounced and I will I will never change. I can't I can't think of him as pineco. It's weird to me. He's pineco to me. Oh god. I didn't- I forgot they did that much damage. Bet. Get him, get him. Oh, those critical hits are so nice. Let's uh go. Just for funsy, I wanna see if this will work. Let's see if I can reach that other one. Uh almost, almost. Okay, it's fine. Restore some health here. Man, I love that ability. So good. Double slap. I think they still do. I don't see why they wouldn't. I don't think they're Wi-Fi based or anything. So I think we could still use those codes. I don't know if the event codes work though. I have a feeling those ones don't work, I'm not sure.
Okay, I just, I think I can get, yeah, I can get some free damage here. Um, but I will wait on that and do this. Oh, I didn't mean to mow both. Okay, well. That's fine. And we can get rid of the pine echo this way. And yes, I will continue to say pine echo forever. Uh, it's too ingrained in me to change it now. <laughs> I will just live with the ridicule. Oh my god, that poison damage sucks. The appearance codes, by the way, if you guys are curious, there were codes that you could use to make certain Pokemon appear. Uh, they're part of, like, events or something. There's also codes for, like, specific uh, additional, like, game events. Um, so you could, like, add extra content to your game. I don't know if they will still work. Um, I don't think they're Wi-Fi based, though, so there's a good chance they will. Pokemon used to be a lot friendlier about, like, letting extra content stuff work. Get him! Oh, so close. The spiel's almost dead. <laughs> I'm out of gummies again. You know, I like gummies, but I hate the way they get stuck in your teeth. It's... It bothers me. I'm gonna have to brush my teeth. I'm gonna have to brush my teeth a few extra times today. I used to have a problem with the grinding of my teeth. And so, um, I have a lot of, like, like, little spaces. My teeth have been sharpened. That it just gets stuck in. <laughs> Don't stop me. You're talking to some that actively will say words wrong to irritate people that irritate me. <laughs> we used to do there was um we used to do that um for my ex roommate. Um she she came from Arkansas. Um so as a joke when we were talking about it, we would say Arkansas. Wow, this guy didn't realize he lost, huh? Now we get some cool new guys in our team. I will recruit you, but can I have your Skullipede? Very well. I will lend you my strength indeed. He used to say Arkansas. I used to have a lot of trouble uh, pronouncing the word pronouncing Yosemite. I had to think of it like really hard. I had to think about like the way that Yosemite Sam was pronounced in the cartoon. Um, because if I just read the word, I would like say Yosemite or Yos Yos. Yo I think Yosemite is the way I would think of it in my brain, but it wasn't like it's close, but it wasn't quite right, right? I swear there was an L in there somewhere. It's gotta be an L, right? Alright, let's turn the magic card. Oh, wait. Um, these guys are... This guy could go here. 
I need a couple people here just to help out the magic herbs. <laughs> Charmander, what's happening to you? By the way, I love the art for Pokemon in this game. All the Pokemon look really cool in this game. Takatora's Charmander has evolved to Charmeleon. Had a classmate. You know when he couldn't spell a word because when he didn't, he would start the word with Q-X. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty obvious indicator, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, these guys can't do too much. I guess I'll get those guys' energy levels up. Try some pony Geary, please. Every time the word would start with R. Nope, Q and X. I guess they just kind of gave up on themselves, huh? They were just like, whatever, I'm not gonna get it right. Oh, I should buy some stuff. I have a lot of money. I didn't get... Uh, he's not very curious. But... Okay, let's And I can't send Magikarp to fight by himself because he does not have any real attacking moves, so we're just gonna live with what we got. Uh, we'll just get this energy up, I guess. What? Who is here? Uh, Wooper. Does anyone have Perfect Link with Wooper that I can utilize? Chikamasa. Who is Chikamasa? 6%, oof. Shikamasa, he is an Ignis, and he has perfect link with Wooper. Okay, let me switch him over here then. March. We have a lot of Woopers actually, but that's fine. I want him to have his perfect link. I'll replace this Piplup dude. So then I will send Piplup and Sawaddle to deal with this Reaper. They should both get some experience from that. All right, so I just need to send him after Woofer and Sawaddle will just come follow. There, now Swaddle's officially been in part of this battle. Link. Let's go. Ding 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 ding. Ah. God, it's hard when there's a bunch in a row. I always do one extra one. You'll just hang out. Why would you move? You weirdo. There we go. Link done. Righto, you're coming with me, Wooper. Banana. Easy. A little bit of improvement in Sawaddle. Wooper, you seem different from the other Pokemon I've been in the past. I wonder what it is. That Wooper is so fierce looking. 
And then the rest of you guys, you two can go here. Raise your energy a little bit. And then shop. Ugh, only 61 and not worth it. Chikamasa. Where is Chikamasa? He has the pip lap. Here he is. And we now switch to Wooper for the perfect link. He's gonna have to train up that Wooper, but it's worth it. Okay, who else needs stuff? These guys do. So, two Zubats. Does anyone have perfect? I don't think anyone has perfect link with Zubat. Sendayu and Yoshi. I don't think I have either of those. Let me see. Uh, can I search by alphabetical? Mm. Search by warrior name. Okay. Sariyaku? Nope. Yoshi? No. Oh, but let me quickly switch to Trico, because I'm going to be using Trico for the next fight. Or, actually, I want to get Venipede, but it's fine. it's fine. I just need something different than EB, because this guy is going to cream my EB if I have it. Okay, uh, let's send a bunch of you to get your energy up. These guys will get their energy up, and the rest will go level up. Tony Geary, please! Don't accept. Right, let's go. Okay, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's go for... This Piplup's okay, this guy is okay. This guy, they're pretty average strength. I do need to keep Cottony back though because of the Zubat, so I'll have the water hips move forward. How? Okay, Blooper has gulp, so it will heal in water at least. What is your ability? Increases range of... Okay. I don't need that yet. Yeah, so he's gonna heal in water. This guy, what is your warrior ability? Um... Yeah, let's do this. Fortify to raise your defense. And then... We'll just help you whittle down this Zubat. What is your ability? Restores HP, cannot move. Okay, well, not worth doing that. And I need to keep these Zubats away from each other because they have melee, so if they attack each other nearby, they'll forget to do an extra attack. That's how melee works. Basically, the way melee works, that ability they have, is that one of them attacks near the other one, then the second one gets a little bit of an extra damage attack. Not a lot of extra damage, but it's still annoying, especially if there's really not a lot of damage going around right now. I'm just trying to whittle these to be back down. I'll be able to kill them in time, but it's going to take some time.
Oh, okay, now they're teaming up on Cottony. Okay. Yep, see, there's the melee. Okay, um, what is your fortify? And I'm gonna have Cottony uh, move here. Yeah, they're gonna go after it. It's okay, Cottony. They had a lot of damage on you. Good news is they're lined up now. Which is exactly what I wanted. Only one to go now. Oh, of course you're gonna steal that. Wow. Okay. Jerk face. But the last new bat will go down. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That should get everyone plenty of experience. Connie, unfortunately, does not get too much because they died. This is a sad thing. I really wish I kept them out of the melee more. That's okay. I think that's everyone that can do something useful. Yeah, so we'll advance the next month. Surprised that he hasn't attacked me yet. Lady Wham, an elderly gentleman has requested an audience with you. Hello there, youngster. I don't think we've met before. I've been researching Pokemon here in Ransay for a very long time now. But it's about time that I thought about retiring. Before I do that, though, I thought I'd better share some of what I have learned with you young warriors. If there's anything you want to ask about, youngster, go ahead. This old man has plenty of time on his hands. What do you want to know about? Uh, stats? Pokemon have the following stats. Attack, defense, and speed. Improving a Pokemon's attack means they cause more damage to enemies. Improving a Pokemon's defense means they have received less damage from enemies. Finally, improving a Pokemon's speed makes it easier for their moves to hit the enemy, while also making it easier for them to avoid enemy moves. Got all that? What do you want to know about? Move ranks, I guess? Now all Pokemon moves have move ranks. Increasing this rank makes moves more powerful and makes it easier to achieve bonus effects after performing a move. Look at the number next to a move to see its move rank. To increase a move rank to its maximum level, you will need to achieve a 100% link with your Pokemon. Moves whose move ranks are at their maximum level are super powerful, so make sure to work hard and strengthen your link, alright? What do you want to know about? Nothing. I'm good now. Thank you, old man. Oh, really? Righto. Just keep working hard, youngster. And your Pokemon are bound to get stronger. I like I was very helpful. I appreciated all of that. Okay. Now what I want to do... I need to recruit some people. And I also want to get that Benepeed. So, let's do... Eh. Eh. Eh, eh. That Benepede will be mine. Now he's got Fire Fang. Chomp. I did not bring a Pokemon to deal with the fire type, I just realized. Come down to me, Benepede. Oh, never mind. Oh, 
Oh, it's got flame burst. That's interesting. Uh, only a silver with Benipede. Dang. Hey, Pluto! Welcome to the stream! <laughs> Thanks for killing you. Thanks for not killing you. Ah. If you travel to the sun on a potato, is the speed of blue the same as giraffe eating- Oh god, my brain. By the way, thank you for the two bits. I appreciate it. They didn't smack me too hard into space, which is great. But that, that question did really hurt my brain. <laughs> Ah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you for the extra five bits. Hey, look, you unlocked the Alakazam. I haven't seen Alakazam in a while. Okay, well, um, I guess I'm not gonna get Venipede then, because it's the perfect link. Actually, wait. I should have gotten it, because I think... I don't remember. Trico was not... Was Trico gold? Trico was not- was it? I don't remember. Maybe I should have gotten it. It's fine. It's whatever. <laughs> Three- how many bits- how many singular bits you got laying around? They're like pennies. You sling out your pennies at me. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Thank you, though. <laughs> I- I like that bit one. Hold on, what is this? Oh, it's the pride flag. Have you, I have been usually seeing the unicorn or the, the heart. I like the pride flag. Thank you. Oh, my Charmeleon's been poisoned. Uh oh, this is gonna hurt. Trying to catch me already, huh? Quick ball's not gonna cut it. Let's see what we can get with this. One shot? Ah, oh, so close to one shot. <laughs> bits aren't lucky. Were you hoping that you could increase your chances with the bits? <laughs> yeah, you could. Third times could be the charm. Itamar got me on the second try, I think. Nope. Got quick balled. Oh, this means that Trico's not gonna get experience. I should've just caught the benefit. Let's move him down. Karma is false. <laughs> <laughs> karma, does, karma does not like you. <laughs> Life is fake. Oh no, Pluto. Pluto is self-destructing. Like this pine, pine echo. You're fake? You know, you probably are fake. You do have Pluto in your name. And everyone knows Pluto is a fake planet. <laughs> Oh no. Someone needs to give Pluto a hug. Pluto is a dog? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that, that face is very concerning with that threatening message. Listen, I'm just telling you what all the scientists say.
You see an account, Goofy does not look like one. I don't think Goofy's supposed to be a cow. I think Goofy's supposed to be a dog. Because Mirabelle is a cow and she and Goofy look very different. Yeah, we trapped you in here. It took too long to get him, so I don't well, we won't get the pan sage, but that's fine. Oh, I still got some increase with Trico. That's good. You looked it up. I think Canis Goofus is the technical term for what Goofy is. He's just Goofy. The Canis implies he's a dog, though. Why it was bullying Pokemon? You know, he needed to get bullied. He was hitting everyone. He was being very mean to my people. Um, I guess I'll just put you here. Why not? And then I should migrate some people to there. Let me march all of these people to here and violate. Look at that blimp. And then I will march all these people here to Fontaine. Just so that every kingdom connected to Pugilis, Pugilis has people in it. I don't want them to like get an idea about attacking me. Dog Lover. Hello, Dog Lover. Do I know how to evolve people in Pokemon in this game? Yes, I do. Different conditions for different Pokemon. Most of them you evolve with increasing their link to a certain level. Some require increasing strength. Eevee has a lot of different conditions depending on the Pokemon you do. Um, some require item. Eevee Lucians still require stones if they need stones. Pokemon that need stones still require stones, stuff like that. So it's somewhat similar to what they usually would be just kind of translated in terms of this game. Very well. This place produces a strange energy. See, one that summons wild Pokemon to the air for a period of one month. You should use the power plant if you want to strengthen your link with your partner Pokemon, or you want to summon some shy Pokemon that are difficult to meet. Use it wisely, okay? Oh, and one more thing before I forget. After the power plant's been used, you can't use it again until it's been recharged, okay? Uh, don't try it yet. Let's do this first. So... Ooh, that Starly guy is good. Um, I have a lot of bug types though. Come on. Crap. Do I have... I don't really have a team I would want to use here yet. Ugh, frick. I could just throw all my Pokemon in there and just hope for the best. Could do that. Let's do that. Let's just throw everyone in. If they have a power plant, why are there no cars? They have a blimp. They don't need cars, they have Pokemon. Okay, I need to get the Starly. So I'm gonna move this forward. Oh, he has a perfect link with Pichu. And I'm a little afraid of the Pichu. But I'm a Quaron type, so I should be okay. So I'm gonna move all my bug Pokemon to this corner over here, just so. No, I do not mean that, Nova. Shut your mouth.
Ow, that hurt. Let's see, what is this guy? Akizane? Do you have a perfectly beat you? He does. Okay, I'll get that while I'm here. Hey, Foxclaw. Welcome to the stream. Foxclaw says, never have I ever. That's your favorite fun party game. Because me and my friends will always make fun of whatever the person says they've done, and the teasing gets worse as the time goes on. Never have I ever is a classic slumber party game. I like that game because I've never done anything, so I get to watch everyone else say things. Free entertainment for me. I'm just gonna keep Wooper alive. It was fun till you learned something about a friend that you wish you didn't. Oh, yeah. You do gotta be careful with those kind of games, you know? Because they can get pretty, pretty, you know, personal. You cannot sleep? Mamoodi, it's like way past your bedtime. You need to sleep. Imagine having a bedtime. <laughs> Some people need bedtimes. Otherwise they make bad choices. Like me, I should have a bedtime, but I don't. I really should though, because I stay up too late. What do you mean it's only 3 a.m.? That's late. It's late. You miss, bro. I need to clear a path here. Okay, let me link with this Pichu. That'll clear a path for me. It's so late that it's early morning. That's true. That is very true. <laughs> Oh, he missed. Great. Just gonna wait till this uh, jump pad works. God, this accuracy drop sucks. You won't go to sleep till I give you a lullaby? I don't like to sing. Lullaby is for the mom to do. Sorry guys, if you ever were if you were ever looking forward to a karaoke stream from me, um that's not gonna happen. I do not like to sing. May you take over the lullaby? You may. What lullaby are you gonna sing? <laughs> you don't have a mother? I thought we said that if I'm the father that hurts the mother. 
It's one for your childhood? What song is it? Oh, here we go. Here we go. God, she's Marie. <laughs> you never have to sleep. Hold on. Foxclaw's about to sing. Give Foxclaw a chance. Sorry, I have to sacrifice you, so waddle for the greater good. <laughs> Box <Club. laughs> Who's saying that to you? Box Club, I think I think we need to have a talk about what lullabies are supposed to sound like. They're supposed to be soothing. Not threatening. You're deaf. <laughs> Okay, I guess it's, you know what, that is totally a dad lullaby. <laughs> that is definitely a dad lullaby. It put you to sleep every night. <laughs> Out of fear, I'm sure. Oh, I thought I got the starly guy. I guess not. Well, at least I got a perfect link Pokemon for that guy. That's good. I need to have perfect links. It's important. Plus, that gets me an Electric type. Where is he? It was which guy? Akizane. You can give a finish lullaby. I'd like to hear that one. Oh yeah, his Akins is only like a forty. Definitely want to switch that off. I wish I knew finish. Same English. <laughs> At least you know English better than I know Finnish. At least you got that going for you.
Goodbye, Bee Doof. I had to. That's part of the objective, is kill the Bidu. It's written in the game. That is some weird Google translation, but that's what you got. You can't watch- I wonder what that's supposed to be. You know, some- why do- why do a lot of lullabies sound kind of threatening? We've been threatening people to go to sleep for ages, huh? Don't kill- <laughs> Is don't kill me part of the lullaby, or are you just asking us not to kill you? send all these guys in because uh, mostly these are Magikarp. <laughs> yeah, and that's what I was thinking about. I was thinking of Hush Baby. It's like, it's like, hush little baby, don't say a word. Don't say a word. Mama's gonna get you uh, something. Don't, so she's like bribing you to be silent. She's threatening you to be silent or else she won't get you those things. She's buying your silence, basically. Thanks for the hydrate. I'll take a sippy. Delicious. Good sippy. Magikarp, go splash! Go splash! Training the Magikarp is gonna be a while. Thanks for the boops, too. How much is a clock? Um, depends. Like a watch? Like a wall clock? Like a grandfather clock? Like an alarm clock? Those are all worth different prices. Plus, each one of those things is worth very different price depending on what brand you get. There on my forehead. <laughs> well, to be fair, it didn't say boop my nose, it just said boop. A boop is not enough. <laughs> Listen, you're gonna have to take it up with the boop authorities, okay? Ah! Uh oh. Ah! Uh I haven't seen a master ball in a while. <laughs> Congrats, my moody. You got the- not only did you catch me, you got the Master Ball catch. Please treat me well. You catch me sus? 3 a.m. is a sus stream. 3 a.m.? 3 a.m. is a sus stream. Who is 3 a.m.? Who are they? Why are they up at 3 a.m.?
I'm not up at 3 a.m. It's only 4.55 p.m. Which coincidentally is almost time to end the stream. Wow. He has boob authority? This cat right here has a boob redeem and it isn't on her nose. Hmm. That's what I said. She said, come take it to you. All right, thank you. It's a police run! Ah! And then I was arrested. I guess I've done the stream, guys. I'm going to jail. But they'll never catch me. You'll never catch me, coppers! Good night. Wee U, Wii U, Wii U. I love the Wii U. JK, what I don't have one. <laughs> Never owned a Wii U, can you believe it? I think the Wii U came out like right after I managed to buy myself. A Wii. So it was like, no thanks. I just spent all my money on a Wii. And now you came up with this new console. And how am I supposed to live my life? Yeah, exactly. I only had the Wii and a Switch. I don't have money bags. What are you talking about? I'm not rich. What has, what has ever given you the impression I'm rich? Do you know how I was able to buy everyone Christmas presents this year? I saved throughout the whole year a number of a, a budget of money for Christmas presents. I didn't go up to Paris on my dime. That was on work money. None of that was my money. And I didn't even go to Paris. I went to another city in France. I was in Paris for like an hour. And that was to go from one part of France to another part of France. Plus, well, the only time I was in Paris was during the Tour de France, so it wasn't really a good time to be in Paris. It was all traffic. We had to fight people to get a taxi to where we were going. Alright, I think everyone did their turns, that I need to do their turns. Which means this is a good point to save. You know what, Nova? You know what I think your problem is? You know why you don't have Paris money? Because Paris doesn't want you. Alright, we're saving there and we're gonna go ahead and start ending the stream. So hang on tight for just a second. <laughs> 